And now, your NBC 26 Storm Shield forecast with Stephanie Mead. Well, it is a frigid morning. We're looking at single digits across the area, staying mostly clear, very quiet right now. Five degrees, though, as you're heading out the door for folks here in Green Bay. Three down in Appleton, and we're looking at one degree out in Clintonville. Cold spot this morning is Anigo at air temperatures at five below. Wind chill factors up towards the north are at around 21 degrees below zero. Ten below in Clintonville, and it feels like it's 15 below out in Appleton. So keep your layers handy for your morning commute, but also throughout your lunch hour as well. We're looking at mostly clear skies. We're going to stay pretty quiet right uh, now and throughout the day on Storm Shield radar. We have a high pressure system in place that's going to keep us relatively dry for today and into a majority of the overnight hours. It's not until later we see a low pressure system off towards the west sweep through the area and that gives us the chance of some flurries for tonight. Feeling very arctic, cold and frigid today. Light snow for tonight and then we do have your sturgeon spearing forecast for this weekend and it's looking like a mild one for the spears. For today we're looking at mostly sunny skies. Really not an issue uh, today as you're heading out on the roads or if you have any afternoon plans, staying mostly sunny and quiet throughout the day. Increase in cloud cover at around midnight and then throughout the morning hours of tomorrow at around 530, we could see maybe a light flurry out towards the Door County area. Quickly moves in, shifts out, and then we see a little bit of cloud cover left over from that system, but that's really about it. And it's not really going to knock us temperature-wise either. We're only going to see temperatures increase as we head into tomorrow. Throughout the day today, we're looking at highs in the mid to low Lower 20, uh, mid to lower teens, and then throughout the overnight hours, we fall to the single digits again. But boy, do we warm up into the lower 30s as we head into Friday. So much more milder air returns into our forecast, which means wind chill factors won't be nearly as cold as what we're waking up to this morning. Still a little bit colder in the mid 20s, but not nearly as bad as this morning. Our extended forecast calling for temperatures for this weekend. In the upper 30s and lower 40s, we could see a little bit of rain Saturday night into Sunday, and then it changes into the mix throughout the afternoon. And then Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, temperatures fluctuating between the mid to upper 30s, lower 40s, and then 29 by next Wednesday. So very mild forecast for February so far. I was going to say, what a change mm -hmm. we are in store for coming up this weekend. It's going to feel a lot different out there. <laughs> yeah, so if you don't like the cold air, don't worry. Mild air is right around the corner. All right, thanks, Stephanie. Yeah. All right, so I had some scared one car causing seven.